Hi there, Sagittarius. Thanks so much for tuning in. I'm Astro Girl and we're looking at May 22nd through May 28th. This is actually a good week for you. It's going to be a little scattered and a little scatterbrained, but the sun a new moon and Mars are all lined up in Gemini, your seventh house of one-to-one -one relationships, and Venus, the goddess of love, is in your romance and self-fulfillment zone. So how can anything go wrong? Well, obviously that's a lot of pressure and a lot to do in your relationship zone and how other people are with you and how you are with other people. Luckily, you are a people person, just to throw in another people. And luckily, you like to be social and hang out and do all those fun things with friends and family and co-workers. But it might get a bit much this week. You may feel like you need a little bit of time off. You need a little bit of time to, you know, hang out by yourself or with your dog or, you know, just sit down and write some checks out and all that sort of thing. And so if that's the way you're feeling, it's important that you recognize that and that you don't allow yourself to get caught up in all the hoopla that's going on around you right now. Sometimes too much of a good thing is too much of a good thing. And this is one of those weeks when there's an undercurrent of not such great stuff going on where you might think that everything's hunky-dory and then you find out that uh, this happened and this happened and this happened. So really just, you know, Take it one day at a time, even take it one hour at a time. Now, the new moon's going to be on Thursday, and it's going to be quite the new moon. It's a great time to start something new. If you and a friend have been talking about opening a business or doing something together, maybe going, I know a lot of people who sell stuff on eBay, and they do it jointly because it's so much work, and they have like, you know, Sally and Harry's, um, you know, boutique, and they put up men's stuff and women's stuff, and make a small fortune out of it. So things like that, maybe you wanted to have a garage sale or sell some stuff or whatever it is. Maybe you own a car together and you're like, it's time to get rid of the car. So you're going to help each other sell it. Whatever it is, this is one of those times when joining forces with other people is a good idea and not taking on the burden of everything yourself, which is a very Sagittarian thing to do. So really try and stay in your lane this week. The Gemini... Uh, new moon. Gemini's, as you know, can be scattered and jack of all trades, master of none. So you don't want to fall into that category either. So if you've got set things that you really want to do and prove, write down those set things. What is it that you want to do? What do you want to have done by the weekend? And if you miss out, what do you want to have done by the weekend after that? And so forth. Thanks so much for tuning in. I do appreciate it, Sagittarius. Don't forget, June 6th. Jupiter moves direct and there's a full moon in your sign. You're coming up next. Have a great week and I'll speak to you again very shortly.